Okay, we are back in the valley and it's refresh day. I'm about to check my results and then check on the premium shop and see what we have going on. This one was for the Brightfully Festive. I really liked voting. I really liked what everybody did. I tried to do something cute. That was my area right over here. But I saw a lot of very, very creative things. So hopefully I did well. Let's just find out. Let's do it. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, 4,000. I wasn't sure about that one. I did go down. It's like I'm creeping a little down. But as long as I get 4,000 moonstones, I'm really in it for the moonstones. And whatever, you know, and the recognition. But obviously to be top one, that's going to take a lot, a lot of work. So I did. Okay, it actually looks like I went up a little. Um, last time... 74.30 and rank 875. I don't know how these messages get out of order. This time, uh, 74.14, rank 555. 555. Five, five. So, yeah, awesome. I'm excited about that. Let's claim this, see what I get in my chest, and then probably go buy something. If there's anything good, I'm sure there is. There's always something good in the premium shop. Alright, I don't think I have that. I know I have that. I'm pretty sure I have that. Okay, yeah. Marble side table. Sweet! Got a new marble side table. Fair enough, at least I got one new thing. Let's go ahead and we'll drop into Scrooges and see if I can find anything good. I'll save the premium shop for last. I'm getting towards the end of clothing. But as far as furniture, I still have tons and tons of furniture to buy. Uh, cute. Is this Cactus Mickey? It just says pink looking sharp mini crop. Looking sharp. That's hilarious. That's cute. Bye bye. That is very cute. Hello. Define dancing. That's a uh, Wally Whoa. shirt. <laughs> it's cute, considered elegant. Nice. Uh -huh. What is this? A running Mickey. These are all Whoa. cute. I feel like I may have similar ones in different colors. No little items left. But I love accessories. Excuse me, sir. I'm Hello. shopping. Take a hint every time. Every time I'm in here, this dude gets literally too close. I got that. I have all this stuff. Nope, not the bed. Woo, 23,000? That is a nice bed, though. It would go good in my villainous uh, castle. Cute. All right, well, that's that. Scrooge, Scrooge, hey, hey, how you doing? You want to check the premium shop with me? Let's go. <gasps> Mushroom Manor. Ooh, I uh, I like all of this stuff. All of this stuff looks cute. Sweaters. It's sweater sweater weather, y'all. These are cute. Mickey in the pocket. Cute, and you get three of them. Nice for a thousand. These are really good. These would have been good for my dream snap kitchen. Pretty. These are pretty for seven fifty. Ooh, that's a pretty low price for dream for premium stuff. But it's probably because they're expecting you to buy both of these. This is nice because obviously I'd want to get all of them to do a kitchen man i'm sure somebody's losing their mind about these kitchen things right now i'm definitely gonna buy this mushroom manor though i'm gonna buy this cute little thing right now so cute it's gonna go right here in the forgotten lands with ah, me 
hopefully I have enough space. I think it would look good in the Forgotten Lands next to Fairy Godmother's house because why not? I mean, she lives in a pumpkin and this is a mushroom. So have like a garden home biome, that'd be cute. Now I demand more. I demand an eggplant house. I don't know why that's the first one I said. Um, apple house, gooseberry, how about we go with stuff that's in the thing. All right, am I gonna have any space to put this little thing down? You know what, it's really dark up here. So I'm gonna put it over here for now, just so we can have a nice little look at it. Oh, oh, and I thought you were gonna be like teeny tiny and cute. I mean, it's cute, but it's not as teeny. Oh, nice, amazing. This is super cute. I love it. It's kind of got a rusty chimney on it. Garden flower detail. It doesn't really match the grass well in this biome, but I mean, I'm not trying to say anything picky. <laughs> These little lanterns hanging from it, those are cute and they're on. Can't interact with it. Um, Nice! I am satisfied with my buy, Mushroom Manor. It's very, uh, fairy-esque. Uh, I love it! What do you think? Let me know. Is that the best thing in the shop? I feel like that was the best thing in the shop. I would like to get everything, of course, but I'll start with this for sure. And then I'll ponder on the next ones. But yeah, this is very cute, very impressive. I like the uh, stone, like the brick stone around the bottom and the door entry. Cute, and it's like pre-decorated garden. This is very nice, very nice. So let's go ahead and see what next week's dream snaps are gonna be. Current challenge. Bedroom beauty. Maybe I'll use my new tangle bed. Suggested beauty and the beast. Lavish. Mandatory. Five bedroom items. Four elegant items. Nice. And it's a decor challenge. Don't sleep on this dream snaps theme. Show the community your most beautiful and elegant bedroom. Okay. That's nice. A bedroom challenge. I wonder how many people are still going to do outdoor bedrooms though. <laughs> because I was surprised with the kitchen. But it makes sense to have a nice outdoor kitchen, you know. But as far as doing a outdoor bedroom, it's not impossible. You can definitely do uh, hammocks or something like that, but I don't know if those items for sure would count as bedroom. I'm gonna go, this was my Beauty and the Beast build. It has a bunch of, be oh, this is my kitchen. Why is the Beauty and the Beast dress in front of the kitchen? Weird. That was my Dream Snaps kitchen. This is my Beauty and the Beast room. I have a video on the Dream Snap from that. Just out of curiosity, it's not a bedroom, but it would be funny if it had enough bedroom stuff in it. Her makeup definitely is not matching the outfit. Because there are bedroom things in here. Let's see. Oh, there we go, y'all. That's my Dream Snap bedroom for the week. Huh. It's definitely, it's probably the sofas and the bookshelves. I'm not sure which of these are bedroom items, but this was my Beauty and the Beast inspired build. I did a Dream Snap shoot with the Beast in here. More Beauty and the Beast stuff over here. But yeah, that's kind of funny. Uh, loose interpretation of a bedroom, but 
we'll probably do a build on that upcoming soon okay I got one of the bedroom stuff cut out but yeah I'm excited about that and I'm excited to do voting on the submissions for the pirate ones uh, I did my pirate one don't know if it's the best pirate run, but as long as I get my free moonstones, that's all that matters, and have fun doing it, and getting better at decorating. As long as I don't fall down, I just want to stay in that 4,000 moonstone area, just so I have enough money to buy nice things, because we all deserve nice things from the premium shop, and I appreciate the free moonstones. You know, beggars can't be choosers, but this kitchen set is very nice have a week to think about it you know don't wanna I'm stingy with my moonstones because I haven't bought any since the game has come out mine came with the founders pack moonstones and then you know just continually playing collecting your moonstones I really like that they did the dream snaps and now because I would only buy very rarely from the premium shop but now as long as I keep doing well I can you know get a little taste get a little taste and holidays are coming I'm sure they'll have like cute Christmas stuff I was hoping for a little more spookiness a little more spooky stuff in the shop you know but we still have a couple weeks till it's actually you know Thanksgiving past Halloween so I guess we'll see so how did y'all do on your dream snaps how many moonstones did you get and are you excited for the next one and what about this mushroom manor this is cute this is very cute what about the mushroom manor uh who can't resist i couldn't resist it's so cute i really really like it and a weird thing in the circling right there it's kind of looking wavy but it's still cute in person i think it's super cute i think it's a very good buy and i'm excited to see what people do with it because people are so creative and very good at decorating and this looks very very cute I think it's probably gonna go into the forest of valor it would look good or the peaceful meadow as well uh, I know that it's probably not just me but these glass crashing colors are probably gonna drive a couple people crazy but whatever it's super cute and I really like it and I'm excited mm -hmm for next week. So as always, thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Bye. It's me, Miss Goldcrusher. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.